Jack mentioned. Just as well stand out in the street, pound on a drum and holler, Detlaf, I'm coming for you. A bit more finesse, I implore you. Let's hear your idea. Give me a moment. Nice. Ever consider becoming a burglar? A skill like that would come in awful handy. I considered it briefly, but ultimately concluded it would be terribly dull. Come. Disturbing. Hmm, somebody fixed this recently. Recently. I find these puppets rather disturbing. Nice little trinket. Sometimes I think I might end up like one of these toys. Attic, let's go. So this is his nest. Need to look around. Hmm, somebody fixed this recently. Nice tune. Indeed. I'm not certain why, but it reminds me of home. True home from before the conjunction of spheres. Tools were used recently. Dead love unwind by fixing toys between murders. Really, now, Geralt, must you? Look, slips of paper, name on each. Count Crespi, Count Dulac, Milton de Peyrac Peyron, Count de Lacroix. Detlaf's victims, one and all, but that's not his hand. All of it written using the same ink. See the color? Ink was dyed with cinnabarite, rare mineral, pretty much found only in. Nazaire, but I fear it means very little. Anyone could have imported such ink. Fair enough. Still worth remembering. The slip is stained. With wine. Not much to go on either. Especially not in Beauclair. Perhaps. 
yet perhaps also worth remembering. Dedloff's handwriting. Seen many samples? A handful, but mind telling me why you ask? Listen, I know you want to believe he's somehow not responsible, but maybe you're just wrong. Could be he himself wrote those names out, stained that slip with wine. No, Geralt, I know him. In a fit of rage, out of passion, I could believe he could kill. But murder? A series, no less. Planned out? It's simply not him. A hideout in the city? Learning his victims' habits, noting down their names. No. Someone is controlling him. Of this, I am certain. Still got nothing, basically. Need to look around some more. Let's get to work. Dedlaf van der Eretain, you do not know us, but we know you to be a vampire. We know also of your weakness for the wench they call Renoed. Now you know this. We shall chain her down and let rats feed on her. We shall flay the skin from her flesh. Yet you can save her. You need but travel to Beauclair, where you shall slay five men in the manner we prescribe. You must complete the killing in three days. Fail, and the next letter you receive will contain a memento of your failure. Your beloved's finger. There you have it. Proof positive Detlove killed not of his own accord. A blackmailer sunk his claws into him. Any idea what it could be? Detlove have any enemies? Indeed. Detlove gains foes occasionally, but they never live long. One might have managed to evade him. Possible in theory, but I know of none. It would have to be someone devilishly dangerous. As you well know, having faced Detlaf yourself, whoever it is, it is someone new. Who's Renawed? His one-time lover. The sole human woman with whom he was very close. Because she accepted him. With her aid and care, he found a place for himself in this hostile world. She began the work that I strive to continue. Ever meet her? Never had the pleasure, alas. She deserted him a time before he came around to save me, though he always claimed she'd gone missing. Take it you have your doubts. I know humans better than he does. Their capacity to be disloyal, dishonest. I also know she took her things. Not something one associates with the kidnapped, or those who disappear against their will. I'll save you the trouble of asking. No, I don't know why she left. I can, however, hazard a guess that Detlaf grew angry one day, showed another, more monstrous side. Detlaf's anger could frighten anyone off, though most who see it get no chance to flee. Detlaf have trouble letting go, accepting that she'd left him? Is that so hard to believe? Do you know no humans who've struggled with just such a thing? And Detlaf is so much more emotional than most humans. Not only was she his beloved, his lover, his mate, she was a member of his pack, and one never leaves one's pack voluntarily. Dedloff ever try to find her? I mean, if she was that important, higher vampires have their ways, all kinds. Should have been easy as pie for him. Geralt, as you rightly noted, we are vampires, not miracle workers. He searched for months on end before giving up. Clearly, Renoued knew him all too well. Enough to cover her tracks, leave no way for him to find her. Even if Renoed did abandon him that time, looks like someone's actually kidnapped her this time. Hard to argue with that, and hard to foresee what he's prepared to do to free her, get her back. He's prepared to kill, that's clear. As would you be for Yennefer. He kills, for he cares for her deeply. And that blood, those individuals, they mean nothing to him. Yeah, I get it now. He's out to rescue a female from his pack. Exactly. Blackmailer. Kinda curious who it could be. Why is that? Regis. Somebody kidnapped a vampire's lover. Bold to begin with. Now they're forcing the vampire to kill. 
a vampire you yourself insisted no murderer. Blackmailer's skilled. Someone special. Hmm. Astute. Now that I think of it, I'm beginning to wonder if... It's not one of your kind? Another vampire? Precisely. The plot thickens. Just a hypothesis. Wouldn't set my heart on it till we know more. Right you are. Let's sum up what we know. Seems Deadlaugh's being blackmailed. Someone's been feeding him his victims' names. All noted down using one and the same Nazari ink. And not in his handwriting. Not much. But enough to ascertain Detlef's innocence, clearly. Actually, it is. Detlef's being manipulated. Some lunatics turned him into a tool, making him kill. So it would seem. But this illuminates a path of action for us. We must find Renowed. Render the blackmail senseless. The lunatic or ticks will thus lose hold on Detlef. That's one idea. Hmm. Could be worth a shot. But what about Detlaf? He gonna go on killing while I'm out searching for his lover? He will not. I shall convince him to stay his hand. Assure him you're a friend seeking to help. I'll await him here. He's sure to return sooner or later. Think he'll listen? He will. I'll await with you, maybe. No. He'll sense you from a mile off. Simply fail to appear. I'd better stay alone. You must trust me on this. Fine. Need to report to the Duchess first. So be it. We'll await you here. Detlaf and I both.